The coronavirus is a pandemic. We have no immunity to this virus. We have no vaccines for the virus. You have to start taking seriously what you can do. More than 300,000 cases of COVID-19 have now been reported to WHO. Liberty University is one of the largest private Christian schools in the United States. However, the school has found itself in some hot water recently surrounding a controversial decision. Amid growing concerns regarding the outbreak of the deadly COVID-19 virus, more commonly referred to as the coronavirus, which at the making of this video has claimed over 27,000 lives worldwide, many colleges and universities across the country are closing their doors, except for one. But one university is bringing students back to campus during this crisis. Liberty University remaining open. Liberty University, led by President Trump's strong ally, Jerry Falwell Jr., is reopening its doors. But that is very different from inviting students to leave their homes and come back to campus. Despite these growing health concerns, Liberty University, run by President Jerry Falwell Jr., has decided to remain open to any student who wishes to return for the spring semester, sparking outcry from the media, students, and even faculty members. While President Falwell is no stranger to controversy, he's also been the target of false reporting in the past, and much of the reporting regarding Liberty's decision has been rife with conjecture, misinformation, and flat-out lies. Because of this, I decided to get to the bottom of things and go to Liberty myself to see what is true and what is outrage. My name is Jonah Lackey. I've been a journalist for a little over two years now, and I have a love of in-person, on-the-ground reporting. Over the course of the next few days, I'll be touring Liberty myself, interviewing students and staff members, and showing you guys what's actually going on here at Liberty. Are the reports true? Is the school throwing caution to the wind and putting its students, faculty, and the greater Lynchburg area at a severe risk? Overall, I think people are not contained on Liberty. Or is it all just fear mongering? And is the school actually taking all necessary precautions to keep everyone safe and healthy? Uh, they definitely, you know, they're following, like I said, all the guidelines by the government. I intend to find out.